I need you to move it. <laughs> okay, Martha. <laughs> Today, I will be going to the store to buy a whole bunch of ingredients. I'm trying to change my ways of eating. After the cruise, I gained probably six or seven pounds, and I need to lose that. And I just haven't been very smart about my eating habits. They're just really bad, uh, especially because I uh, was breastfeeding. So when, you know, breastfeeding, I, you just want to eat everything. You're always hungry. I am no longer breastfeeding. And now it's going to be harder for me to lose the weight since I'm not breastfeeding anymore. When you know when you breastfeed, you lose a lot of calories. And now that I don't have that going on and I'm eating the way I'm eating, I'm definitely not going to lose any weight if I don't change my ways of eating and start going back to the gym. So I, I keep seeing these like overnight uh, oatmeal uh, breakfast cups. I'm sorry, I don't know what it's called. I really haven't put all of my attention to what it's called, but it's oatmeal. It looks really good, so I'm like wondering, okay, well, let's try this out. Every morning I grab, you know, my cup of oatmeal, and it, I know oatmeal is good for you, helps you with your digestion, and all of that so let's see how this works so we're gonna go to the store real quick and we're gonna buy everything that we need so that we can make these little breakfast cups for the whole week so let's go so we're at the gas station you know our routine we're here for some snacks we are not getting gas today though mm, tank looks pretty full so I'm looking up right now for all the ingredients that I'm going to need for this oatmeal. I guess you put it in like milk and stuff. So I'm looking on Pinterest. Uh, let's see, oatmeal recipes. So oatmeal recipes overnight. They have like overnight oatmeal in the slow cooker. I've never heard of that. They have banana in it. There's some that are specifically for fat burning. There's some just to give you energy for the day. 11 overnight oatmeal recipes you love. Oh, I wanna do that, overnight oatmeal. We're gonna buy all the ingredients we need for that. <laughs> are you uh, in a good mood today? Sleep. <laughs> Why are you tired? Oh, we cool. went to sleep at the same time last night. I, I feel great. No. Okay. Okay, we got everything that we needed. Now we're going to put it together and see how it comes out. It looks like it's going to come out pretty good. But we can't taste it yet because we gotta wait 24 hours. <laughs> I think it's eight hours, really, not 24 hours. But I'm just gonna wait overnight because it's overnight oatmeal. Uh, anyway, yeah, let's go. Well, we made it home alive, thank God. So now we're gonna go inside and we're gonna prepare this oatmeal of mine to have it ready for it tomorrow. So, let's go. All right, here I'm gonna display everything that I just got. So I got a lot of stuff. I got here the vanilla, the cinnamon, 
I actually got the sliced almonds. I got the quinoa, the chai seeds, the Greek yogurt. I actually picked this one. I left the other one because this one was cheaper. We got the almond, uh, unsweetened the vanilla. Uh, we got kiwi, we got strawberries, and bananas, and because my husband likes to be mean, he went and bought this. You know, I'm trying to lose weight, but he always got to do something for me to want to mess up my diet. It's your diet, not mine. I know that, but you got to help me with this, okay? You can't buy stuff like this, okay, and expect me to lose weight. It's hard for me to say no to a cookie, okay? So now that you guys heard me rant, this is going to work. This has to work. I, I can't gain another pound. I can't. I'm too short for this crap. I'm glad you guys are in this journey with me because I'm, I gotta get serious. So let's start this. I'm just trying to create a nice balanced breakfast so that I don't gain weight. I need to cut this in little cubes. So wait, you ain't doing nothing with that. What are you talking about? You wanna eat that? Nah, baby, I'm just gonna decorate the place. That's what all are you doing, man? I'm trying to set everything up. So you can blend it, right? No, I'm not blending nothing. So when you wake up in the morning, you're gonna eat like that. Okay, so since you really wanna know what I'm doing, what I'm doing is I am cutting a half a kiwi, third cup of strawberries. I'm also going to put it together with chai seeds one tablespoon. I am going to put uh, one teaspoon of vanilla. I'm going to do a half a cup of raw oats and then a cup of yogurt, which I got um, vanilla. <laughs> okay, and then I'm going to mix it with the almond milk. So I'm this is supposed to sit on the line? Yes. You, wow. If you're so interested in what I'm doing, would you like to watch? I'm curious. Okay. So. What I'm gonna do is, I just cut half of a kiwi. It said a third cup of strawberries, which I don't have anything to um, measure it, so I'm just gonna wing it. Then after we do that, we're gonna mush it all together. Mush it? Yes. Why gonna, not just blend it? Because it doesn't have to be blended. It just needs to be mushed. And this is- uh, That's not a good question. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I got it, I got it. Okay, so I'm gonna do this with this one. It's not working either. Give me a fork. <laughs> Give me a fork. Why do you need a fork? <laughs> My helper. After you mush it all up, we're gonna put the chai seeds and oh, thank you so much, sir, Mr. Barnes. Okay, so now that I have it all mushed up in here, my helper here is gonna open the chai seeds. I want to help. I'm which, just curious. <laughs> <laughs> which we need one tablespoon. A chai? Look, they got a measure in here. Oh, cool. That's just, not, it's not even a thing. So we're going to put this in it. What is that supposed to do? So far, this is what we're looking like. This is for fiber. Okay. Now that that's done, we have to put, uh, oh, maple syrup. So we're gonna use our tablespoon, which this doesn't, this is really big, but this is what I'm gonna use. And we're gonna do a teaspoon of vanilla. I got me that All right, so we got that here. Now, we're gonna do half a cup of yogurt, which I got this one. It said for it to be not flavored, but I wanted vanilla. We're just gonna use the cup, this cup right here so we can measure. So half a cup of yogurt. I searched up different different recipes. One said this, one said that. So I'm grabbing from here and grabbing from there and I'm making it my own, so whatever. It's still healthy. All right, so now we got that in there. Mix, mix, mix. We're gonna need a half a cup of oats, okay. Nice. Oatmeal is great for your metabolism. Just mix this up. Now we're gonna put half of a lime. 
You squeeze it real nice, try to get as much out as you can. And now we're gonna put half of a cup of almond milk. Okay. Okay. Now that that's done, I'm gonna put it in a cup. So we're gonna fill this. I'm probably gonna just do half a cup. Okay, so I'm gonna do up to here. And I'm gonna leave this space for uh, tomorrow's toppings. Like, I'm gonna cut up some strawberries and I'm gonna put some almonds on top of it. And this will be my breakfast. So I'm going to, since I have this whole bowl, I'm gonna make a whole bunch of cups and I'm gonna seal them up with um, plastic wrap and then I'm gonna leave them in the refrigerator and I'll have breakfast for every single day this week. It looks pretty good, so never tried this before. This is my first time ever. So let's see how this goes. So we're gonna put this away and we're gonna see you guys in the morning. Good morning guys. It is currently 9.30 in the morning and I am ready to see what the hell happened last night with this oatmeal. Alright, let's see. So it looks pretty good. Let's get it out of here. Let's get this off. Okay. It looks good. It looks good. So we're just going to put some toppings on it. And let's uh, make it look pretty and let's eat breakfast because I'm hungry. I'm going to put these strawberries on top of it. Okay. And I'm going to put these sliced almonds. Ew, Tatu, you're eating all fancy. And I'm also gonna put some honey on top. It looks really, really good. Okay. All right, so we're gonna mix it up a little bit. And, mmm, it's actually pretty good. It has a bit of a bitter taste, I guess it's because of the yogurt. But it's still good. The fruits make it great. The almonds give it a nice crunch. And the oatmeal will fill you up. So I don't see why not have this for breakfast. I can totally do this for the whole week. After this, I have a cup of water. I think I'd be good for lunch. Now I gotta figure out what I'm gonna eat for lunch. I'm gonna put the ingredients down below. You guys should try it. If you like it, let me know, comment. Also, if you have any other re recipes for overnight oatmeal, please let me know. Anything that you guys tried that you guys actually enjoyed. Let me know so I can try it out. I really need new things to eat in the morning, especially some, something healthy. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, guys. This was a journey to get this in a cup. It was actually pretty fun to make it with John. I wasn't expecting for John to actually help me, but even though he really didn't help but his presence was nice, I guess. So yeah, till next time, guys.